and the last part arrived for the solar panel install. So that's it. We're gonna go out, prep the roof, and see how much we can get done today. Let's get going. So the first thing I did several days ago was I took a piece of VHB tape and just a piece of plastic material. I adhered the VHB tape to the roof. You can kind of see it under there, hopefully. The reason I did this is because I wanted to see if I got something wrong, is it possible to get this stuff off without, you know, doing damage or that kind of thing? And from what I understand, alcohol will remove the VHB tape. I've got some alcohol, and I'm going to see if that actually is the case. As you can see, the alcohol is removing the and the plastic. Now, once I've got the alcohol off the surface, is it possible to get the VHB tape off? Yes, it is possible. There are some critical things you must attend to one is that there can't be any gap between the surface that you're sticking to and the bracket that you're sticking to the surface. As you can see, I have bent the bracket. You can see my little bend marks. You can see that now the bracket is mirroring the contour of the surface it's being attached to. All right, so this is how I have the bracket set up in a drill press wise. And then with a large crescent wrench, I just get in here and pry backwards and come over here and do the same here and the same here to, in order to keep the, uh, the bracket relatively flat and straight. All right. So there it is. I hit my marks precisely. The panel is definitely stuck down and the VHB tape looks like it took up any little possible, you know, gap area, stuff like that. And, uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's not going to go anywhere, but it's also going to get another layer of Eternabond over it just for a safety measure to try and make sure nothing moves around. And yeah, my cables are just right there out in the back. Well, the job's complete. Here are the solar panels, all installed, nicely centered. Nicely centered and uh, I have one wire here coming right down beside the uh, third backup light held in place with one zip tie and scooting over into the van inside so I think I did a pretty good job overall. I'm happy with it and they seem to be working really well. There you see the panels. Uh, got them up, got them installed, they're centered. One little wire comes down to the inside of the van and that connects everything to the charge controller etc. Uh, one thing is a highlight in my video that isn't in other videos is BHB tape is removable with alcohol. You can squirt some alcohol and remove the VHB tape without too much stress or strain. So if you did make a mistake or did need to move something or maybe take a panel off one vehicle and put it on another, uh, it is possible to do it fairly easily 
I've seen people cut it with a knife and do all kinds of things, but just a little alcohol will, will definitely remove it. Might help somebody if they get a panel on crooked or drop it and can't get it back up, something like that. You waste the VHB tape, but at least you don't have some co cockeyed thing to deal with ongoing. The solar panels are putting out between anywhere between about 130 to 150 watts. It really is a nice improvement to the van. And I think my urban camping kind of situation that I do a lot of, it's probably the best way for me to go because it is more convenient. Uh, if you're buying a small quantity of it, I would be careful to make sure you're dealing with somebody that repackages 3M brand VHB tape and is authorized by 3M to do that. Just make sure you get it from a reputable source because uh, you don't want to buy weak tape and install heavy solar panels and have some kind of a liability on your hands in the future. That's it. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you think it would help somebody else, please share it with them. If you'd like to get more content like this, then subscribe and ring the bell, and you'll be notified when new content gets posted. Thanks for watching the video, and as always, comment as you see fit. Till the next video, see you later.